Hello, I'm Nick Riddle, Quality Control Manager, Skeeter Brush Trucks. In this video, we will cover the operation of the Scotty Foam System on your Skeeter Brush Truck. The Scotty Foam System is through the pump foam system, so foam will be pumped through the suction side of the plumbing and supplied to any discharge on your apparatus. First, a word of precaution. Do not mix types or brands of foam. If you need to change types and brands of foam thoroughly, flush the entire system to avoid mixing, which can cause permanent damage to the foam system. First, you're going to want to check and make sure you have enough foam in the foam tank and that you have a sufficient water source. You want to be able to flush your system after flowing the foam. We all know the foam is corrosive and it's best not to leave it in the system. Open the foam supply valve located on the tank, just under the foam fill tower. Start your pump and have water flowing through your discharge of choice. We'll be using the hose reel discharge with a variable foam nozzle installed. See the Skeeter Brush Truck video on pumping your Skeeter Brush Truck for additional information. With the water flowing out of your discharge, you're going to want to close your tank fill valve. It's very important, otherwise you'll fill your tank full of foam solution. Once you got that closed, you open the foam flush valve and you turn the knob on your Scotty Foam System. Once you have your foam flush valve open on your foam proportioner control, there's a placard on the top. It'll tell you the approximate percentage per the turn of the dial. The more you turn the dial, the more foam you're going to receive out your discharge. Once you're done flowing the foam, you want to close the knob all the way. This will stop the flow of foam to the discharge. You want to allow the discharge to continue flowing water to flush out the system. This shouldn't take very long at all. Once you've completed flushing out the system, you can close your foam flush valve, close off your discharge, you can open your tank fill valve, throttle your pump down, and shut off the pump. For training purposes or just operational knowledge of our trucks, please follow the links to our other videos. If you have any other questions or comments, feel free to visit us at SkeeterBrushTrucks.com. To be sure you receive notifications for future videos, like and subscribe to this channel. Thanks for watching.